This will be a short review dedicated to the next version of Blender 4.5. As you probably know, full support for Vulkan has been added to version 4.5. And to demystify all speculation about performance, I will test one scene where you can clearly see how much performance has increased in Uport. Good frame rate is most important for animators, so by the way, the Blender 4.5 still in beta and release will be somewhere in the middle of the July. Let's jump into the scene. Here we are in Blender and it's version 4.5 beta and to turn on the Vulkan you need to go to preferences system and here you need to change instead of OpenGL change to Vulkan and you are good to go that's it by default it's still OpenGL but yeah you need to change because some problem with uh, VR performance and war and I have the same scene opened for Blender 4.4 so let's check how it works 4.4 will give us around 14 with 3 characters and very simple scene 3 characters from CC4 character creator 4 so yeah it's around 14, 15 frames per second so let's check 4.5 and we'll see that it's much eh, much better actually yeah it's almost 18 and a half almost 19 but if we turn on one character for example this one and in version 4.5 also 4.4 and if we check right now 4.4 .4 and 22 around 22 it's almost because the scene is 24 uh, frame per second but if we check right now 4.5 you will see that the frame rate is actually very nice, it's all we need to have right now. That means that in uh, 4.5 I can work with two characters easily, animate them and we'll be sure that I get the real and smooth performance in viewport. It's all about viewport and performance in viewport. So, yeah, so it's definitely worth to change to Vulkan AP. It's around, yeah, it's around maybe 20 25% of performance and that's nice so I hope it was helpful so see you in the next video guys bye